Hey, what's going on guys? This is a little bit unplanned video and the point is that eventually uh, or finally I've realized that I'm really tired of this kind of camera integrated web camera uh, application uh, that I'm used to make use of during recording my programming videos so what I usually uh, done was kind of making this slow and always on top and just place this over in here and this is the exact picture you kind of used to watching me uh, during uh, all this web scraping tutorials and all other videos on the Colin Kobank Kings channel. So, you know, like, I don't really like that this file uh, menu is available, and also, you know, like, the, the, there is too much information on Windows. So, I want to just have the picture itself and the bare uh, window title and that's kind of it so in this video uh we're gonna implement uh a simple uh, a simple python script that would actually give us uh this like output so we'll have uh our uh, our camera view with uh, with only window title and that's kind of it and the library i'm supposed to be using in this little tutorial is OpenCV and uh, the CV2 module in particular. So mm, that's that's kind of uh, really complicated stuff, and it's probably uh, harder to actually install that OpenCV, uh, which is not the topic of this tutorial. But I just want to uh, provide a very simple code snippet that would actually allow you to make this nice pretty uh, camera view that fits uh, video recording uh, for not video recording but just uh, showing this window with the webcam view uh, during recording programming videos so if someone someone some of you would ever probably like to record some programming videos with your face available uh, along with 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 the content itself this this might be the case the use case uh, for you to consider. So, uh, in order to actually write the actual script, I need to close this one because otherwise uh, uh, it just uh, won't be able to uh, reference the camera. And now I just uh, create a new Python document. I call this uh, webcam.py. And uh, here, let me just provide what the script uh is supposed to be doing basically so uh i say like simple simple script to display a webcam camera web camera view uh yeah that's kind of it basically so nothing much really so uh and now okay uh, and now we need to import the only package, so uh, import package, and we need uh, only to say like import CV2, and that's kind of it. Uh, to, be honest, to be honest, I'm real dumb in this uh, OpenCV library, so <laughs> uh, I'm not really gonna be diving that deep into what am I doing here in particular, but still, just want to provide the working script uh, and that's kind of it. So the very first thing to consider, we need to provide uh, the capture variable that would be equal to cv2 dot video capture and the zero as an argument. So uh, here we can say like uh, create uh, uh, webcam web camera webcam uh, capture stream. So it's literally just uh, open the webcam, uh, uh, the webcam basically. So, uh, or maybe not great, but just in it probably. And as far as we're done with this, we also need to create a, a window that would actually uh, be showing uh, this stream for us. So here I say create output window. And uh, as far as I'm aware, that uh, OpenCV library is based on the Qt GUI backend. So uh, I can definitely say that this would work on Linux because I'm on Linux. I'm not sure how exactly this is supposed to be working on Windows. Uh, probably there is some 
way of doing that but unfortunately i'm not aware of that so uh what i need to say here i need to say like cv2 dot and uh, we're making use of what is known as named window like this and we need to provide two arguments so the first one uh, is the window name and at the si same time this name uh, would serve as a title for our window so i just co type code monkey kin here just to reference by my own self basically so code monkey kin and also provide some flags to specify uh, the window uh, to specify the window um, settings so i use cv2 dot window GUI normal and there are two uh, two way uh, two types GUI uh, window GUI normal and GUI and window GUI expanded or extended expanded probably and the expanded one has like uh, border borders around the uh, actual camera view and some uh, you know like uh, toolbar and some unnecessary things that I really want to get rid get rid of and now let's well also we'll need to resize the window uh, to fit the proper size but uh, for now I'll just drop it and uh, here I would like to provide uh, a main loop, main loop basically so uh, I will go the most dumb way possible I say something like while true and here we need to create two variables so the first one would be the material and the second one would be called frame and here uh, we need simply to say like capture dot read to actually read from our input stream so I can simply say like read input camera stream right stream uh, webcam stream okay and now we need to show our mm, show uh, or maybe a bit better say like render uh, input stream input webcam oh maybe just render webcam stream uh, to the window to window uh, maybe better to say like in window okay and here uh we need simply to say like cv2 dot and there is a nice function called im show which is probably stands for image show and here we need to specify the window we want to uh, show our uh the way the window where, where we want to show our stream at so in our case it's the cool monkey king window so it's both title and window name at the same time so code monkey king here and then what actually we want to uh, show and here we want to show the frame and the very last thing left here is uh, uh, actually handle exit uh, of the program so handle uh, uh, script exit and here we can simply say if uh, cv2 dot there is a nice uh, function called wait key and it takes one as an argument equals and now I'm converting this uh, the character to like uh, its s key uh, value here so I'm using the, this tilde because it's the most rare use probably thin uh, on the keyboard but I don't remember the last ten, uh, the, la the last time when I used that so in this case we need simply just to break out of this loop and eventually and finally we need to uh, make some cleanup uh, so here we need to say capture uh, dot release to actually close the web camera stream and also destroy all, all windows by saying uh, cv2 dot destroy all windows and that's kind of it and now i hold my breath and try to open the terminal in the current working directory so it's over here open a terminal and by simply typing python 3 webcam dot pi I hope to see yeah my face perfect so the very last thing to consider you see like this uh, uh, 
this window is resizable well maybe not the best ever way to resize it but still it's kind of kind of works but i just want to make it like little uh just to make it possible to put it somewhere uh at the uh, right uh, part uh, right uh, bottom corner of the screen so if i just uh, use the tilt uh i just escape the program so the very last thing to consider here is actually to uh, resize window or maybe I can simply say like just set a uh, window size and here I can say like cv2 dot resize window and again code my keycane window as an argument and then I need simply to specify the width and the height so let's try the 240 for uh, 100 and I don't know probably 60 not sure so let's have a look what kind of uh, image do we have now okay so it's a bit still it's not not the best ever so uh, I guess uh, yeah I want to make it slightly slower uh, okay uh, uh, well, I guess 90 would have been just perfect here. So let's let's see. Oh, <laughs> okay. So uh, I guess let's try this. Okay, still. Uh, okay, hold on a sec. Okay, let's try 160 for 140, and and I guess this one would would work okay now this is perfect so uh this is exactly the output uh i actually wanted to have uh for my tutorials but because you know like it's uh it's little enough so you can just put it right over in here so the face is thin also kind of uh, well, uh so basically a little little window so the code is just fine uh, i just want to must set this to always on top so now i can basically keep keep on recording my videos and this is kind of it so well uh, uh, another thing to consider that uh, actually uh, Komaki Kin <laughs> is not a uh, scene here uh, for some reason okay maybe I just should have rem uh, renamed this uh, somehow and well, maybe just co code is enough basically so okay uh, so probably Mm, yeah let's keep it like code and that's it so you can even go for, with a lower case and one last trick to consider here is actually uh, I don't really want to open this from within the terminal so uh, in order to achieve that we can simply say like uh, user bin and Python 3 so I'm specifying the line to the interpreter to use to open this kind of file so I now can just uh, close all this stuff entirely and I also need to set the properties like allow execute as the program and if I now just double click this and choose run yeah so here I got my uh, what is this yeah so here i got basically my web camera view which is i personally consider it's much better than it was actually in previous and well also uh, uh i could have made this uh kind of uh in the grayscale just like before just like uh, is as it was before in previous but you know like mm, i don't know i think those gray days are over and it's summer now and just why not to keep to keep it colored so this is kind of it for this video guys so uh i hope you've learned something interesting out of this and find something useful for your for your own selves uh i'm sorry for not uh, diving that deep and not explaining that much regarding the code because you know like i'm i'm, I'm an expert in web scrape and not in open cv library so uh, just uh, uh, as a showcase uh, of an example of how a programmer can make something something useful for his own self, basically when he wants actually to, you know, like creating some some useful tools when 
uh, you don't you can't find uh, some existing ones so just uh, uh, for about 10 lines of Python code could have make the uh, make make the deal for you make all the work all the jobs done and this is pretty nice so minimalist but exactly what I wanted it to be so uh, wish you all the best uh, wish you all the best guys so until the next time and take care